So hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Erica. If you're new here, hello. If you're not, welcome back. And um, yeah, I guess if you're new here, hit the subscribe button. I make lots of beauty related content, skincare content, and yeah, just overall lifestyle stuff. I'm really into sort of the beauty community and skincare and I love all that stuff so if you're interested stick around check out some of my other videos enjoy yourself leave a comment down below so we can chat but today I thought it would be really really fun to review some of my favorite lip products so I'm not somebody who wears a lot of lip products usually it's like a tint or oil infused type product so that's what I'm gonna be showing you today because I feel like on a daily basis something that's really simple and easy to reapply is what I sort of gravitate towards so it's just really easy when I'm at school when I'm at work when I'm on the go like anything like that I love to use these types of products so let's get into it so I'm gonna start off with oil infused products and I feel like they've been around for a while but they're making like a comeback like some companies are either reformulating redesigning or adding more colors to their ranges and I'm really excited for that because I love oil infused products I feel like they're so nourishing some of them have amazing color payoff and they just feel so good on the lips like I'm not somebody who likes matte colors at all I stay away from them I don't buy them I don't like them but when it comes to oil, ugh, drip it all over, get it all over my lips, I love that. So we are going to get right into it and I'm going to start off by prepping my lips so I could show you guys all these lip products. I've mentioned it before, the Sugar Lip Wonder Drops from Fresh, I am obsessed. It makes my lips so luscious, so soft, so plump looking, so that's what we're gonna start with. Um, here it says dispense a drop and massage it over clean lips and lip contour area until it absorbs. So we are going to do that. I'm going to use a mirror so I don't miss my lips as silly as that sounds but so I'm going to grab a drop. It's in the dropper. I'm gonna put a drop on my lips and just massage. So you go all around the lip area, You, it says even the contour, a drop goes such a long way also, I feel like I have too much on my lips even. It tastes very sweet, I'm not somebody who likes to eat my lip products though, so please don't eat your lip products, but I love this. It really takes care of the dead skin, especially in the winter time here in Canada, it is rough. Your girl is dry, my nose is dry, I had to go out and buy a humidifier because it was just too much for my skin. Like. I have never experienced a winter like this. It's something about the wind I feel like this year. It is just really harsh and my skin was crying. It was like, please love me. Please add a humidifier to your house. So I did, I listened, I listened. Oh my gosh, it was like that meme that I saw recently. Maybe I'll post it on screen, but it's like <laughs> when you do your skincare, but your skin don't care and I was like, Oh girl, I feel that. I'm like, sometimes I spend lots of money on my skin and it's just like, mm, not today. Like, we're not feeling you. You are gonna have crusty, dusty ass skin and it's just not gonna look cute. But anyway, I'm gonna start off with some of my all time favorite products. And these are hella expensive. I only have three and these were amassed through birthdays, Christmas, like, days after i did exams back in university i was like ugh, i need to treat myself so these are the ysl wow this font is tiny um volupte 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 something like that volupte and these are the tint in oils i have it in color i think these are numbered so this one is 18 it's like a orangey corally color this one is 20 and it's like, I don't know, honestly, 20 and five. Somebody tell me the difference. You know, it's like when you look in your skincare and your makeup and you're like, why do I have 300 of the same exact colors or the same exact products? But I do. This one is five. I feel like five is a deeper color and this is more, I feel like they're both raspberries though. Actually, why am I struggling so hard? I'm gonna go on Sephora's website and I will tell you <laughs> what they consider these colors to be. YSL, um, what are these called? Oh, Volupte. 
Voilà, see. Oh, no, not the bomb. No, I want the oil. YSL. Okay, so I actually looked on the Sephora website and I couldn't find these um, Volupte oil in oil color things. But I did go on the Yves Saint Laurent website and I actually found them there. So I don't think their names are on here, but let me just read them to you because some of them are really cute. So I'm going to start in order. So I think five is the smallest number here. Okay, five. Five is... Let's see. Is five not on the website? Oh boy, what is going on? Because these aren't on Sephora anymore. So maybe they're like a discontinued product. Interesting. But anyway, I'm just going to get right into it. And you can kind of decide what the lip color is um, while you see it on camera. So I'm going to start with number five. Okay, so here you can see it's a very fuchsia fuchsia pink. And you can see the doe foot applicator is kind of bent there, but honestly, it is so nice to use. Wait, that's how they are. Okay, I was just making sure that's how they are and I didn't like damage it, but they're just really nice because you can really get in there on that flat end and it just adds such a nice amount of gloss and color. Like look already, you can see this part of my lip like darkening. Mm. And they all have this mango smell that is just to die for. And if you are in the market for like a gloss like this, I love. I think they're even on sale on the website right now. So if you are interested or if you do like what's going on here on my lips, pick it up because it is beautiful very moisturizing the oil is beautiful the mango smell is like honestly what sold me I'm a huge mango person mango I love mango 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 so since it is like a lip tint it does darken to this color so when you leave it on your lips and throughout the time that you're wearing it it does darken up very nicely you can totally tell that you're wearing a tint so it gives you some color without like committing to reapplying a color throughout the day and that's why i love these oil lip tints because or oil lip tints in general the color darkens the tint darkens so you have that color payoff once the shininess goes away and it's just so nice so that's this color this one's number five mambo number five and i only like that song because my name's in it you know a little bit of erica by your side not spelled correctly Admittedly, because my name is spelled with a K, but you know, it's a song. You don't hear the spelling, so number five. Beautiful. Now I'm going to move on. I'm going to use my makeup eraser, the original. It has sloths on it. They're little festive sloths. I bought it for myself. I like treated myself over the holidays. It is adorable. It came with like hair clip and stuff. So cute. So we're going to wipe this off. This part of the cloth is wet, actually, just so you know. <laughs> so we're gonna wipe off this color. And now I'm going to go in with number 20. Yeah, uh, actually, for the sake of it, let's go in order of numbers. I'm gonna go in with 18. And this is like the orangey coral color. So same deal, doe foot, orangey, corally. Also another beautiful color. So I'm just gonna go in Again, there's not crazy color payoff, but you definitely see the color that each one of these is. It is more orangey. But just again, such a nice gloss and it does add a nice amount of shine to your lips. Smells like mango also. And the packaging is really cute. I love like very minimalistic packaging and seeing like the color around the middle part. Very, very cute. So you can let that intensify a little bit. It is a very orangey coral color, very pretty. Makes my lips look bigger. 
not by much honestly but it does make them look a little bit more full which is cute because my lips aren't crazy full at all They're pretty average to the smaller side but they make them look nice they make them really stand out i feel so like my ear my ear was standing out <laughs> so that is that color so now i'm going to take the makeup eraser that's damp in that corner and just wipe it off and i'm going to go in with that last color which is number 20 and i'm going to put it all over my lips So this one definitely is like a darker color. I think this is more of a deep raspberry. So you can see it's a little bit more dramatic than the other ones. So they definitely are different colors. Really pretty. This one's really nice because it gets really dark. So it definitely is like a lip color. So here is the color. It is a dark raspberry color. Really pretty, really dramatic, I feel like, because my skin's so pale. It really does have that like contrast to it. And then even when you wipe it off, you still have the color underneath. Because your lips are like stained. So it's always there then you just throw in like a lip balm so your lips don't look crusty and you still have the nice color so it's still there it's still really nice now next we are moving um we are moving from the ysl uh Volipte oil and lip tints and we are going to move towards some of my favorite oil products also or just more oil products honestly and we are going to move to the new lip glow oil from dior so if you are familiar with dior's lip products they do have the revive bomb and i added this bomb in this review or sort of tell all about my lip oil obsession because it is like the og i feel like of lip tint bombs or it is just the bomb that did it the best it's beautiful like just look at the packaging it comes out they even have this like limited edition or like new edition one where they have like Dior written in pink all around it like how cute it's honestly beautiful it is such a nice bomb and even sometimes I pair these two together which is honestly how extra can you get welcome extra but wow they just look so nice because this one's such a nice like color bomb like i remember i wore it a few days ago my boyfriend's like are you wearing color on your lips and i was like mm-hmm it's all this so easy so simple it adds such like a nice color you can use it like a bomb so it doesn't really matter where you put it because it's not like it's crazy color but you just add it and it just bam color bam beautiful like you can tell this does it and does it so right and it has so many other colors i think it even has a few sparkly ones which honestly we'll have to look into and maybe give you like a full review of some of the other colors in the line because uh, it's just so nice it's so easy to pack in your bag the bomb stays the bomb lasts and it's so nice it has so much color and then this is the lip glow oil so it does the same thing in essence so if you're more of like a glossy person it has a huge doe foot applicator like a huge like girl what but it's so easy you put it on you can even see how the tips like pink in some areas like where the where see how that tip i guess the oil kind of like stains it that way but like that's what it's doing but that's what it's doing on your lips and it's just so pretty like sometimes you just sit at my desk doing work editing all that stuff and i'm just like oh just so nice tastes so good don't eat it but it's minty it's so nice and minty and look how pink my lips are no lip plumping it's strictly like oil infused glossing very very soft very pillowy and this combo dior wow for like a minimalist 
not as far as money goes but like for somebody who doesn't want to have a lot of products these two products are just beautiful it has dior like that's like etched in and it's just so pretty it's so wow and i think i'm really late on this because i feel like a lot of people have this as like a holy grail lip balm but it is definitely a bougier holy grail lip balm so it is expensive but so worth it like it is so worth it i do get the hype this is in color 001 it's their pink it's just like the very original basic one again i'll link everything down below in the description and this thing it's just so nice like for somebody who likes gloss but doesn't want to look like too extra the pink is just beautiful you know that you have something on your lips and mind you i'm not wearing a lot of makeup but it still looks so nice it's like yeah she she's had some color she's alive she's living so I like it. It's cute. She cute. So I'm going to take that off. Very short lived, honestly, because when I wear these products, I wear these products. These are like everyday kind of bombs that I just use all the time. So it's sad to take these off, honestly, but it's all good. It's off. So now I'm going to move on to two other bombs that I absolutely adore. I think they may be around the same price or honestly a little bit cheaper, but these are the NARS, what are they called again? They are called Afterglow Balm, which let's just take a moment that this is the lip glow oil and this is Afterglow Balm. So honestly, I feel like 2019, because I think these were released in 2019, maybe early 2020, it was all about the glow, you know, glowy skin, glowy lips, glowy eyes, like just glow, glow, glow. And I'm living for it. 2020 is going to be my glow year because I love glowy products like i have combination oily skin so girl if i can own that glow and say it's a glow and not my oily ass like just dripping everywhere then i'll i'll take it so two colors that i love when they first released the um i think it's the um original one so um they only have names so this one is i don't know if i'm allowed to say this word put it on the screen i think i think you all know like when nars has some very interesting names like their og interesting name with the o you know so that's what this one's called because honestly i haven't taken the time to learn what i am and what i'm not allowed to say so i'm not going to say that word in this video but you know i'll put it on the screen it's this one and this one's called um dolce vita so it is a darker color so i am obsessed with this one because i feel like this one very similar to this Yes, it is lighter, but very similar idea. So they're both like tints. They both work very similarly. Um, I feel like you get more, it feels like you get more product with the Dior one. I could be wrong, let me tell you. Huh. 3.5 grams for Dior and you get three grams here. So I was right, you get a whole 0.5 grams more with the Dior one and this one is just skinnier, lighter. It has bulkier packaging, I feel like. You can see how it's like longer. It is bulkier, but it's thin. So I think I like this one more just because it's like hand size. This one's also hand size, but it's, it's pretty, pretty long. So here, if you look at it, I'm gonna put it on. It's just, oh, I was not in focus. So again, it's just another bomb. Super nice, super pink. I guess the theme today is pink. I, I tell myself, I don't like pink. I'm not somebody like pink is not my color. I wear a lot of pink clearly. So again, on that same sort of theme with pink bombs, love them, love them so much. So that one's just really simple. Pink, like your lip color, but better if you have like pinkier lips. And the Dolce Vita is a newer edition, so it is still new. Oh my god, my lips were so dry one day and I put like crease marks. I don't care, let me see if I can try and show you guys. I put crease marks. Oh my god, you can see it. Ugh, so gross. Now my lips have the sugar, like, what is it called again? Sugar wonder drops. No crustiness. Let's try and flatten those out because that's gross to look at. So this one is a darker color and I like it for when I don't want to make like a pink statement. So if I'm just going for more like toned down looks. It is darker. You can see that it is a little bit darker. 
And if none of this is coming off on camera and I just look like a freak who's putting on the same pink color over and over again, please, please, you know, just bear with me. I love these products so much and I guess a lot of the times you just have to go and try them out yourself because everything reacts differently to your lips, right? The warmth on your lips changes the tint and like how your undertones and your skin tone affect it. But I just think these are so pretty. These are so easily wearable. It's like a balm that's there that's keeping your lips moisturized and giving you some color i think it's like win 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 because with those matte colors they're not moisturizing your lips they're not helping your lips they're like sucking and killing and drying your lips out so that is my take on that it is a darker color really like it it's really nice again it just sort of makes you look like you're wearing makeup when you're not which you are because it's a tint and it's a little bit dramatic but it's not really dramatic because you know it's a balm it's doing your lips justice it's making them feel nice and soft so that's that love it love it so much dolce vita from nars and again the big o for the other one that i'm not gonna say because i'm not sure if i'm allowed to say that or if i'll get demonetized maybe saying demonetized will get me demonetized i don't know so here you go here's the color let's wipe those off now these next two <sighs> wow how did i live without these i don't know i don't know erica how did you live without these okay so these are bobby brown's crushed oil infused gloss now i didn't know about these until they released this one which is called spring bliss and it's one of their new colors and what does it say on here a ray ya fe ra yo Okay, let's try and figure this out. Yara. Yara? Yara. Yara? Let's look it up. Because I know this was on Sephora because this was a new release. So let's see what it is. Oh my gosh. So this one's actually no longer available on the website. But I'm sure you can buy it on like Bobbi Brown or like another reseller of Bobbi Brown. So I'll just like link that in the link. In the link that in the link. Oof. Link that in the description. But this one is the oil infused gloss, so crushed oil infused gloss in the buff. So I'm gonna start with this one because this is a newer one that I bought because I went back and I'm like, okay, if this one's limited edition and I got it, I'm happy with it, I'm thrilled. I want something that's gonna always be there just in case, clearly just in case, because they don't have that color anymore. And I think it just might've been because it was limited edition, but this is the same idea. However, they are color pigmented Ooh -wee. they are so pigmented and so nice so you really get whatever color you pick out it's pink i know i know fight me but it's like a dusty pink and it's just different it's the same but it's different just that's all i have to say i am not gonna justify my purchases you know it's the same it's the same, but it's different. Wow, it's so pretty. It's so pretty. It doesn't taste or like, like there's not a crazy scent to it. It just, which I like. Yes, I do like scents and perfumes added to stuff, but recently I've been really trying to get away from that. So any of my newer purchases, like especially skincare, scent free, fragrance free, like all that stuff. Like I don't want that, get it out of my skincare. I don't need it. Like I have sensitive skin, don't need any of that. We're trying to be scent free, fragrance free in the 2020 decade, you know? But this color, really pretty. It's cute, it's a cute color. It's, the oil is there, it's moisturizing and you get color, like win, win, win. So cute, so cute, so cute. Now, this one. I was about to be like, girl, this is my holy grail. This is all I love. This is like my everything. But apparently this item no longer exists on the Sephora website. So why you gotta do me like that? I loved you. But anyway, I'll show you what this one looks like. So this was the, uh, in the buff. Yeah, beautiful color. It's like dusty kind of pinky color. Yeah, peachy pinky really pretty really like every day like you want to throw on some color you want to look alive throw on that mascara girl throw on that color cute cute i love this thing honestly the makeup eraser 
it works it works so well add some water wipe off that makeup do your double cleanse it's one more thing to make sure that you get everything off you know so this is the Yara collection and it is spring bliss so if you can find it at your local Sephora like in stores because online they're just playing us but if you can find it in stores or at like a Bobbi Brown counter or like something like that I don't know if that exists but if they do get your hands on this if you were anywhere near my skin tone it just looks so nice it is such like a raspberry color it's beautiful I love it I love I'm getting my graduation pictures done for the second degree very soon so yes I'll probably post a video about that I don't know how crazy I'm gonna do my makeup honestly I think for my second graduation picture within a few years you know honestly they're probably gonna look exactly the same one's gonna be a red lip from before and one's gonna be probably this lip to be honest but maybe I'll film it maybe not let me know in the description down below uh, description let me know in the comments down below if you'd like to see me do my graduation makeup and sort of the process like getting there taking my pictures how I keep my hair alive in this weather you know because I'm a commuter so commuting to get my photos taken is a mission to keep your hair looking like it did when you look at yourself in the mirror in the morning especially because my pictures are in the afternoon and I have class in the morning so that's gonna be interesting that's gonna be a mission honestly in itself I'm but yeah if you want to see that video hit the thumbs up button let me know down in the description box but how beautiful is this color spring bliss is that what I'm thinking about right now looking outside the window absolutely spring spring where are you all I see is snow 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 there's a huge window behind the camera, so snow, snow. Why is it snowing? Maybe because it's January in Canada. <sighs> but yeah, so this is beautiful. Spring Bliss is my ish. Probably gonna go run over to my local Sephora and see if they have any more and maybe stock up and buy another one because it's just so beautiful. I just wanna be like, here's Spring Bliss for you. Here's Spring Bliss for you. Like, you know, like a magic wand for you. Or like Oprah, you get spring bliss, you get spring bliss. I wish, I wish I could do that. Just like shoot these out to everyone. Everyone who's watching this video, I see you. But here it is, love this color. I love to end with this color because this is what I'm gonna be wearing today. So it's really nice, really pretty, really wearable, honestly. With makeup, without makeup, I just throw this on and it's like, ooh, she has a cute lip on. And you're like, yes, yes I do. I didn't even try, which you didn't because these are so easy. So if you are looking for something oil infused that has a lot of color payoff, definitely check out Bobbi Brown's um, Crush Oil Infused Glosses because there are so many colors or at least colors that I feel like would be flattering for many different skin tones and they just look really nice and they're easy to use, easy to wear, no crazy smells and they're just very comfortable on the lips. So that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you made it to the end, congratulations. And I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you maybe found some new products that you'd like to check out or test out yourself. And if you have any comments or anything you want to leave down below, definitely let me know. I love reading all your comments. I love getting to engage with all of you guys down there. So I'll see you in the next one.